Hi, in this video I'll show you how to change the time scale of your Gantt chart. So this is the Gantt chart pen. So this is the time scale. At the moment it is two tier. The bottom tier it is on days and the middle tier is on weeks. 23rd, 30th December and on and on. Let's make some changes in it. First, let's make it one year. So you would see, so only only one year time scale will appear here. So it's a 23rd, 30th, and on and on. So since it's on week, so let's make it two days. So you see now it's a time scale is on days. If you are interested to change it to three scales, let's make it three scales. At the top tier, top tier should appear in uh, months and uh, bottom tier should appear in weeks. At the bottom tier, sorry, middle tier should appear in weeks and bottom tier should appear in days. Let's click it. You see here now, the bottom tier it is in days, middle tier is in weeks, and the top tier it is in months. You can change it to quarter also. Say for example, we want to make uh, the, the top tier in quarter. So you would see in quarter wise changes will appear here. So the, now the time scale is showing that the top tier is in quarter, middle tier is in weeks and the bottom tier is in days and you can change the format also for example weeks should not appear like this one we want that the week should appear like this one the week one week two week three on and on so you would see so this will appear like this one and we can also change the format of uh, the top tier also let's say quarter uh, so we want to make it to typically like this one quarter one, quarter two, quarter three. So it will show up like this one. And uh, bottom tier, if you see here, we want to make changes to like, uh, it should appear like day one, day two, day three, or day one, D one, D two, D three. So it will also change like this one. So this is how we can change the time scale of your gear chart. Thanks for watching.